Hi, everybody. I'm Laurel Didier. I'm the publisher of Closets and Organized Storage, and I'm here today with Christina Ralea. Did I say that right? It's Ralea. Ralea. You're fine. Christina Ralea. <laughs> Sounds better that way. Okay, so we're here today to talk about the trends in closets as well as um, a great association that's doing really wonderful things for its members as far as training and certifying. So I'm gonna just turn it over to Christina to just tell us a little bit about yourself. Hi everyone, my name is Christina Ralia. I'm with a company called JB Cutting Incorporated. Uh, JBC is a nationwide door, drawer front, five-piece wood component manufacturer. Uh, we're located about half hour north of Detroit in Michigan. I've been with the company for 20 plus years and I can remember some of the times uh, back in the day we only had about six colors, white, almond, hard rock maple, chocolate pear, summer flame, uh, starting out with a, just a few door profiles and it's just grown and grown since yep. back in the early 2000s. I hear that some people don't want chocolate pear to continue. <laughs> yeah, I, I hear that too, but uh, surprisingly it's like our number three selling color. It just yeah. keeps coming back it and just coming keeps back. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. So I also want to mention that Christina will be the president of the ACSP, that's the Association of Closets and Storage Professionals, um, starting next April, correct? That's correct. Yes. Correct. April of 2023. Yes. Now, I've been with the ACSP since early 2017, and I started off as part of the communications committee doing the newsletters, um, helping create the Facebook page, helping create the um, LinkedIn, all of that fun stuff. Yeah, Social media marketing, yeah, newsletters, that kind sure. of thing. Yeah, it's a, it's a great, great industry yeah. association. It and I'm, I'm super excited about being president. And you know, I will say that Christina did a great job with communications and marketing. So <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, everything Laura. always looked very professional. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. So, Christina, why don't you tell us a little bit about what you're seeing in your business as it relates kind of to COVID? Because, you know, we know everything changed. It did. It did. Uh, back in 2020, you know, JB Cutting was not deemed an essential supplier. So we shut down the business. Uh, we had the executive team come in and run production, and we learned a lot about the way that we do business. We worked hard to obtain some, um, ex to become essential. We had to get letters from our customers. We called everyone back, and it's been nonstop ever since. Yeah. Yeah, it's been. It's, and I'm, been from, I'm from Arizona, and our governor made any type of woodworking construction essential so we right. never shut down right and, um, so it's kind of like in Arizona the attitude is COVID what you right <laughs> right there was no COVID yeah for sure but um, so what what are you seeing in trends like what what do you like well so we recently went through a significant color revamp on our palettes um, early in 2022 we dropped about 40 colors to make way for 20 new colors. Uh, we're still adding colors. Uh, we're seeing super mats trending, embossed and register colors trending, high glosses, uh, the juxtaposition between a, a high gloss uh, paired with a very highly textured wood grain. That, that kind of thing is super popular right now. Yeah, and you know, the high gloss was kind of, um for a long time, the only place you really saw it was like in the South Florida and right. kind of the LA area. Right. It's and now making it's, its way to the mid center yeah, of the country. Exactly. We're seeing a lot of demand for shaker doors and drawers. Those typically are our top sellers. Yeah. New, new for 2022 uh, is our narrow shaker. So it's a shaker door that kind of splits the difference between a traditional and a contemporary with a thin, about half inch rail, styles and rails. It's it's very, very trendy. I saw it on your website and it really What did you is, think? I think it's really sharp. Yeah. The only, the only thing I don't like is, is I, 
is that you can't put glass in it. So well, you would have to get a thicker style. You get a thicker yes, shaker with the for glass, the glass for a glass doors. door. Got glass it. is always trending, especially in the home storage industry. Yeah, it's shop your closet. That resumercial feeling, boutique right. feeling. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. So, um, other other things that you can tell us about is with ACSP as an association, some of the new programs that were introduced Ooh, this year. Great question. Yes, as you know, as incoming president, we plan to continue our educational opportunities for members. We've got a new program coming up. It's going to focus on regional events. Um, this is tentatively called Designer Days. Uh, it'll be hosted by ACSP suppliers, and this is my predecessor, Mr. Marshall's legacy, which I'm very proud to continue. Yeah. Yes. That's wonderful. Oh, and our new director, Amanda Conger, revamped our website, and she's doing a great job. She'll yeah. be here at the booth this, this yes. week at IWF. Do you know what that booth number is? Oh, shoot. I knew you were going to ask me that. I think it's the that. concourse in the C in Hall. In the BC Hall, I BC believe. Hall. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. And, you know, um, some of the other things at the ACSP that is really important is networking. When you go to the, the ACSP Facebook page, there's just literally hundreds of questions that are posted. Yes, by in your, the Facebook forum. Yes. Every day. Every yeah. day we solve problems. We help people find solutions like new manufacturers or new materials. There's relevant questions that are answered, asked and answered by yes. our members every day yeah. there. And if you're, if you're interested in joining the ACSP, you can just go to closets.org. It doesn't Correct. get any easier Correct. than that. Yes. I mean, the real value of an industry association is what it brings to the table, right? Now, yes. the ACSP focuses on networking, products, best practices, education. Um, whether you're a designer or a business owner, a vendor or an installer, joining the ACSP means you're serious about honing your craft and bringing your opinion to our industry. Exactly, exactly, which is really important because it's a relatively new industry in comparison to like furniture or cabinets. It really only got recognized in the early 2000s. Yes. So um, it's, it, it, having an association makes it legitimate it also legitimizes gives it yes everyone a home certifications available whether yes. you're a designer or an installer so that's a relatively new program yes. as well installer installation yes and next year in uh 2023 the closets conference and expo will be in palm beach florida yes returning April, returning returning to palm beach yes. florida which was a great location wonderful location and that'll be april 12th through the 14th and there will be um pretty intensive designer roundtables as well as um, installer clinics yes acsp um, will be offering certification at a discounted price yes. at the show so and the, good reason to attend. And the ACSP is our, our partner. We're very Correct. proud to partner with the association on the educational program. Yes, we can't thank Woodworking Network and Closets and Home Storage Magazine enough for the support that you give us. Thank you so much, Laurel. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, so anything else you want to mention in closing? Oh, as no, just as... that becoming a member. I mean, it's become... A family to me. It's not just a, a group of individuals. You know, these these are my family. Yeah. So it's just I've a good camaraderie feeling. Come get your opinions heard. Yeah. You know, find out how other people are doing things. Ask questions. Just become part of the industry. I feel I feel the same. I'm yep. so passionate. I launched the magazine, um, which should be over there. Yes. Yeah closets and organized storage in 2004 um, when we realized what a great association and um, and industry it was so um, correct so thank you for listening today oh, thank and you for having uh, me. and Christine I really appreciate you taking time out from a really busy schedule at IWF so. anytime all right thank you everyone bye thank you bye bye